on the left part you have properties and project browser sometimes you will find the project browser on the right side like this or or it will be here um, for the properties uh, when you are not selecting anything here it shows you the properties of the view that you are opening when you are selecting for example a column it shows you the properties for this column you have the type selector and something called the type is dealing with the type properties as we said in the previous video every element belongs to type and the type belongs to a family and the family belongs to a category so every element have some properties because it, it belongs to this specific type and some other properties which is called instance properties that are here according to its location and its use down you have the project browser it's like uh, seeing the uh, project from uh, many uh, views um, if I open for example this sample project here I have the 3d of this project if I click second floor now I see the view of the second floor if I click on north then I'll be seeing from the direction north and so on that's the project browse from from it I browse all the views including the schedules for example concrete beam schedule and the sheets which will be printed later as you see all of this is considered as views in the lower part here we are having um, two bars the first is the view option bar all of these tools are related to the specific views that you are opening when I'm in second floor and they change the uh, scale for example to five one to five hundred uh, it's changed only in this view not in the other views not in the 3d okay the lower uh, bar here we have the work set uh, options and the design options and lower here we have the filter for example and some other tools that we are that we will be using while we are working